My name is Jose Hernandez, and I'm an astronaut at NASA. What I would say to uh, Latino youth uh, in terms of uh, being able to achieve their dreams is to don't give up. I think, uh, I think the, the, the key is that uh, the, the students uh, have to realize that one should not make excuses uh, with respect to the perhaps the social economic situation they find themselves uh, because I myself I can trade poor stories with the best and and I, I don't accept that as an excuse I think they ought to look at myself they ought to look at Franklin Chang Diaz as examples of what can be accomplished if you put your mind to it if you are willing to put the work in if you're willing to get an education and you're willing to chase that dream. Because I tell the kids, you know, there's a difference between chasing a dream of becoming an astronaut and chasing a dream of becoming, say, a soccer player or a football player. Be because typically, when kids chase those dreams, and I have no problem them chasing the dreams, I say, if they're good in those sports, they should. But I emphasize to them, you have to have a backup plan. And a lot of times, these kids don't they don't get a good education so if they don't make it into the pro sports they're out there washing cars doing those type of work on the other hand if you chase the dream of say wanting to become a president or wanting to become an astronaut well there's certain steps you have to take before that and the steps I took is why well, I knew I had to go to college I knew I had to become an engineer and I knew I had to work hard in my career so what's the worst thing that could happen if I don't reach my dream of becoming an astronaut? I'm an engineer, and a good engineer. What's the worst thing, perhaps, that if someone doesn't reach to become president, they're probably a good lawyer, or they're probably uh, working in some uh, big company with a college degree. And that's what I tell the kids is have a backup plan. It's okay to dream and go for the dream, but always have a backup plan. And education is the key to that.